channel. Today's video is going to be my week 41 Slimming World update. It's been another crazy week, another one, and I just thought we'd have we'd have a little chat about things. I have been a bit naughty this week. Well, last week I have been quite a bit naughty. I have been really quite ill, and it's the first time that I've actually been ill since the whole time I've been doing Slimming World. So obviously I've never known how it's going to affect me before. I mean. That I haven't really got an excuse, that is just what it is. I was just feeling like just really poorly. I had like the worst cold and everything. I know it's like sounds only a cold, but I think it was like more fluey cold. Like I just couldn't get out of bed and I was achy and cough and everything, all the all the fun stuff. So it's just one of those things and all I wanted to do was eat pizza, watch Netflix. If you've seen my vlogs then you'll say that like that's what I said I wanted to do, so I did. In 40 weeks, I have not done that. I haven't, like, had a week of binge or a week of being really not, apart from obviously going on a holiday. But I just said to myself, this is what I'm going to treat it as, like a holiday from normality because it's not a normal week. I don't feel right and all those things. So I did, I just treated myself and I did have what I want. And, you know, I, I, I don't really feel like I regret it now um, because... That's what I felt right to do for that week and it's just one of those things. So obviously I gained, which is what I totally expected and I was expecting half a stone because my scales are saying half a stone. But I have gained five pounds. So yeah, five pounds. So the only thing that I'm bugged about is that it takes me to four stone 13. If I can keep it like over five stone, I'm actually all right with that and i don't really mind how long it's going to take me but so i just like literally this week all i want off is a pound i just want to get over or two pounds would be nice but i don't know so just getting up back over at that five stone threshold i always say and i i'm just a campaigner for this that i really 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 want everyone to just accept gains i really want you to just see it as normal. Don't chicken out and don't not go to group because I nearly did, I nearly did. And then I thought, no, because this is what I preach and I'm gonna practice it. I want you to go to group if that's how you're feeling. And if you know you've gained, you've had a bad week, get your butt back to group right now. <laughs> Just imagine it as compulsory. If you imagine that going to group is compulsory every week, you can't miss it without fail. I know we all have life commitments and blah, blah. But if you can just go back to group, you don't need, it doesn't matter if it's half a stone, you've gone back. And I'm telling you now, the minute you go back, you've weighed in, sit down with um, your, your Slim World pals and whatever and have a conversation about the week and all right, it's gonna make you feel better. And the minute you, you've done that, just get straight back on it. I mean, I know on Monday night, I went for a great meal and you know, it was just after weighing and I was still feeling rough and Ed finished the same time and it was late and I couldn't be bothered to cook. So I did, we did just go out for that but it could have been a lot worse. <laughs> but, you know, it's just one of those things, gaining, gains are gonna happen, big gains, small gains, whatever, it's gonna happen. But the main thing is that you go back and that is what I had to convince myself to say, like, you know, Till, what, what are you doing? I'm sorry if you can hear a weird noise in the background from washing machine. Um, you know, Till, what are you doing? Don't chicken out of going to grow it, no matter how ill you feel, just go. So I did and I felt glad that I did and I'm still not 100% in the mind frame, but I have so far completed yesterday and today so far on plan. So I'm hoping to get back in it, but I'm still all like blocked up and all I want to do is crawl into bed. So do forgive me, do forgive me, but I want to normalise the game. That is my aim <laughs> with my Super World Diaries and things. I want to normalise it. I want you to not be ashamed of it. I want you to just go in with your head held high and go, do you know what, oh well. Yeah, we're all standing in the queue and our heart races like mad, especially when you know you've gained. And it's just like, and you're like, oh my God, I feel so ashamed of myself. But the minute you get weighed, it's just like a weight's lifted. Right, I've done it, time to start fresh again now. And that's that's the be all and end all of it. That's all, nothing else is gonna happen from you going. The lady sat weighing you, or gentleman weighing you, will not judge you. They have probably been on a weight loss journey as well to become a consultant. They will have had weeks like this, but the fact is they probably have kept going back and kept going back. And that's where you get your results. You can't give up. You've got to just keep going. As I always say, just don't give up and go back to weigh in, go back to group. Just don't just go, oh, well, I've put on, so I'm not going to go anymore. I'm going to eat back another stone because 
that's what I've got off now and because I've put because I've gained two pounds I'm, I'm gonna just put the whole stone back on now there's no point you look how hard you've worked look how far you've come and like I was saying to myself and so many of you have been so kind to me and said to me look till it's not five stone it is five pounds and it's not a massive amount well it is a massive amount really but it's not in the grand scheme of stones it's not uh, so you know there's nothing more I can do about it it's done and dusted you've got to just think of it as a nothing so campaigning to normalize the gain <laughs> so my product of the week this week has to be this no added sugar topical fruit crush which is from Sainsbury's and it is obviously sin free because there's just like no added sugar nothing in it so this is really really tasty and it's really nice if you want an alternative to just drinking like diet pepsi or anything like that it's something a bit different and also it's great because i'm trying to like not drink so much caffeine and you know just cutting out like more rubbish <laughs> you know even after that i am trying to like not have so much coke and this is basically a really good uh content for that i do drink a lot of water and i do have a lot of juice um like cordial as well obviously no added sugar cordial so i do have that but like at night i tend to have a diet pepsi with my dinner and like it, the trouble is because of the caffeine in it like i'm awake for hours then and i can't go to sleep because i used to have coke all day every day and i didn't ever used to drink anything else but now i'm like trying to inject a lot a lot more water obviously and it's just a although obviously fizzy drinks aren't the best thing in the world to have if you fancy one one without caffeine is probably better than for you than pepsi i mean i'm no doctor but that's just what I think anyway, and I try not to have it as much as I can, but, uh, you know, when you fancy it, it's quite good. So that's everything I've got for you this week. I've got really nothing else to discuss. It's just one of those things. There's nothing else I can do about it. I've just got to move on. If I lose, I lose next week. If I don't, I don't. Hopefully I will. Even if it's just half a pound, I'll be grateful because it's cutting into that. But I'd like to just get a pound off at least, so I'm just back into the, the five pound zone. So I haven't also um, gone to club size because obviously I've still been feeling rough. So, yeah, it's just like, I just feel like I'm just a bit out of it. So I'm sorry, it's just not completely like regimented, but I'm not very well. And that's, that's it. Can't do anything about it. So, <laughs> you know, it's just one of those things. So for next week, fingers crossed, I do have a loss of some kind. And I've just been seeing you all doing so, so well. Like um, my lovely friend Nikki from, um, she's called um, Nikki Connolly. If you search for her on YouTube, she's doing amazingly well. Like, you know, I can't believe she's been doing it 14 weeks now. And she's just doing so well. She is absolutely gorgeous. And I love her. I love her channel. So absolute pieces. So you can check that out. I'll link her channel below. Also, Naomi Ray. It, her channel is Nay Ray. And she's Sunny Nay Ray on um, Instagram. Also doing absolutely amazingly well. I'm just... Like, there's just so many people that I speak to now that I've made genuine friends with and your all your comments on Instagram and everything just lift me up all the time. And I'm just so, so grateful to have such a lovely community of all similar interests around me. It's so nice. So, anyway, I will catch you guys next week for week 42. So, have a great week. Good luck and best of luck at weighing. And I will see you then. Thanks for watching. Bye.